Hey everybody, welcome back to Valhalla. I have unfortunately had a little bit of a slightly relevant setback. My speakers decided to die, and uh, I've used a headset for most, like, well, all of my recording, really. Um, so it doesn't direct you affect these videos too much, but it uh, doesn't mean I'm going to have to spend, I don't know, I spent around 100 bucks on the original pair, I think, maybe, maybe 80? I don't know, Parker. What do you think? Um, but yeah, so that's not going to be cheap to replace. I, I like using headphones, but not all the time. You know, it's just not a very casual thing. But uh, if you want to help me pay for that, you can always use, support my patron. You even get Parker pictures. Yes, they do, Parker. Yes. Yes. <sighs> anyway, oops. Well, back to it. I also discovered um, sound cap Elgato sound capture. That's my capture card. Um, it has this thing where I can output to multiple audio devices, which is something I've wanted for ages. Uh, virtual audio cable can do it, but it's a real pain in the butt. Um, Elgato Sound Capture does it super easy, so I can output sound over HDMI and through the PC's sound port, so I can like uh, use my PC headphone jack instead of the one on my monitor, which the monitor outputs, Parker, a lot of noise. So uh, I guess Parker's going to be sitting in here. Okay, hold on. I need to lock the keyboard if you're going to do this. No! What did you do? God damn it! You just skipped half the game! What did you do? Okay. <laughs> For Pete's sake. This this is why I installed the thing to let me lock the keyboard, but I keep forgetting to do it. Alright, let's pretend none of the last two minutes happened. Hi everybody, I'm Tap Tap. Um no don't drink that. It's mine. Ugh. I'm gonna be all itchy too. That's that's the other fun thing of when Parker helps. I get itchy. Parky! Just lay down, please. Just there you go. Alright. Rise and shine! Oh yeah, but Elgato Sound Capture, if you ever wanted to output, like, to a TV and your PC, um, it's really useful for that. I don't think you need an Elgato Sound Capture card to do it. Um, it also helps for, like, streaming stuff to mix in your audio and, like, play with stuff, but, uh, it just happens to solve a need I've had for a long time. So, despite my PC speaker breaking, I'm a little ahead. Uh, well, I mean, some good, some bad. Good morning! It's 11 a.m. though. It's morning for me on the weekends. Yeah, they're a day. Wait. This is... Did I not save? Did... Hang on. Oh. Did I load the wrong save? Yep, I load the wrong save. Okay, yes, this is the one with the obscene bill. I am told that if I don't waste money, I might be able to live... I guess, GSF, January 4th card. Oh no, we already read that. That was the Sunday, 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 etc. Nothing from Kira Mickey! Right, lately. Uh, let's just go to work, I guess. I hope this isn't too spoilery, but... Oh, not, not the shop. Go to work. Um, I heard there's three chapters, so I... I thought I would finish this in an average amount of time, which I've heard is like eight hours. But I then I remembered me reading aloud is gonna make me a lot slower than somebody reading just the text. Hey guys, you're alive! Hey fuckboy. How the hell did you get in? I have a copy of the key, remember? Wait. That's how you greet me after this many days? Never doubted you'd be fine. If anything, I'd have to cut your paycheck for leaving so many days without notice. Oh, poor fuckboy. See Jill? He'd be here on Monday like nothing ever happened. Wait, why does he have a copy of the key and I don't? Need for you having a key never arose. True. Anyway, glad you're fine, Gil. Thanks, I guess. What? You gonna make me watch the bathrooms again? Yes. There is so much piss. It's a it's a it's a piss nami in there. Listen, I don't know how what the hell you really who the hell you really are. Or what's What's trying to come back to bite you in the ass? But remember, there are people that actually care about you. Don't just leave like you did. Come on, fuckboy. We care about you. Especially after all hell broke loose. Just give us a sign that you're still alive. So were you worried? 
Isn't that normal? When it comes to you, I don't know. Shut up. She's right, though. You shouldn't make ladies worry so much. I wonder. One of these. Oh, nope! I keep forgetting that's the exit sign. Let's put on the good one. Yes. Yes. Okay. She's right, though. You shouldn't make ladies worry so much. Check if the cats didn't move the internet antenna, would you? Fine, fine. Hey boss, why, why do we have wireless internet in a freaking? we should have wired. Come on, peoples. I'm already itchy from Parker. This is what you do to me. You make me itchies. Does that are you proud of yourself? He looks very proud of himself, in fact. He's doing that thing where he's on his side and his paws are in there and he's just clenching and unclenching his paws. Very proud of himself. Anyway, hey boss, why'd you leave the hoodie at my place? Because it's yours? I told you you could keep it. Sorry, I couldn't find it myself to take it. Why? Probably because I didn't feel right taking it. But mostly because I thought you'd totally look cute with it. I see. Don't think I'm rejecting a gift of yours, it's just... Preserving cuteness is one of my principles. Ah yes, the preservation of cuteness. One of the fundamental laws. Right. Uh, boss? Not last night. I think I said one too many things, and, uh... So what? Drunk banter is something you see every day. It's not like I'm gonna think less of you because of it. That was... That was the soberest drunk banter ever. Like... Wow. Anyway. Relax! If anything, I feel closer to you after seeing you so wasted. Oh. See, I don't give it too much thought. <laughs> Stupid meat <laughs> Uh, antenna's fine. Did I miss anything? Nothing. Let's go. Okay, your face is red. I'm fine. Alright, music situation. This would be easier to deal with if the previews were like instant. That is not instant. This game is under 300 megabytes. It should fit entirely in my computer's RAM. In the RAM of any reasonable machine made in the last 10 years. Um, how dramatic. Nah. See, I, I would, I would mess with this if I could get the previews instantly. Instead, I'm just gonna leave it. And then, yeah, we we said that a lot. Hey, Gil, what's up? Glad you're fine. I mean it. Thanks. Excuse me, I'm looking for Dana Zane. May I have your name? Tell her it's Brian. Just a sec. Boss, some Brian guy is looking for you. Tell him I'll be there in a bit. Chill, uh, you heard her. It's alright, I'll wait. It's weird for someone to come asking for her, though. It's not so weird when you're BTC's regional manager. Oh, we're, we're so screwed. Oh, I didn't even notice. I did not even notice you got the thing. How many necks do you got going on there, bro? You got a turtleneck and a v-neck, like... Not a v-neck, but I mean... I bet there's like a third neck under that. Yeah, I guess that's... Um... I guess I didn't give you the best first impression! Haha! <laughs> Haha! <laughs> Don't worry. I know who I'm dealing with. I'm not a fan of people treating me too nicely because of my position anyways. Hand me like I'm just another client. Alright, I can do that. What can I get for you, Mr. Brian? Let's go with the basics. A sugar rush, please. Coming right up. Oh, and apparently, I forget if I mentioned this, apparently if you don't do Jill's thing, she doesn't give you any hints at the bottom here. You still hear all of the dialogue, so you should know what to make, but you can forget, and that's how they implement being distracted, I guess. So, in theory, you could save a lot of money, as long as you actually know what drinks to make. Because that's just a little extra hint. There you go, buddy! Sugar Rush! Yeah, this one's nice. Yeah, this one's nice. Back in training, they made a big deal out of Sugar Rushes. Why? They're like the fried eggs of mixing drinks. They're the most basic thing, but people can still mess them up. 
Sugar rushes are simple enough that you only need to follow instructions. If you can't even do that, your future as a bartender is not bright. Huh. They never told me that. You're Jill, right? Yep, that's me. Dana has talked to me quite a bit about you. Really? And I guess you must have a few questions for me, am I right? Not really. Mostly concerning the closure warning about Holocaust. I guess so. You disclose- er, can you disclose any information? I shouldn't, but you have the right to know. Thanks. Don't mention it. Now where to start? You saw the news on the information leak that- the, 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 During the Apollo Trust Bank incident, right? About the White Knights having lots of members from criminal organizations in their ranks? Turns out the White Knights weren't the only ones with shady people. Some of those same folks have been trying to elude legal problems using BTC certified bars. The BTC bars have their own protocols. I mean, the White Knights can't dig too deeply. At least, not without going through a ton of paperwork first. Giving the criminals time to cover their tracks. Though it takes a bit of time to set up, it has apparently proven an effective method for money laundering. How do you money launder with a bar? Like, why, why don't you just give... Whatever. Where's Valhalla come in? Young bars are the ones under the radar right now. The modest to low income ones are primary suspects. Would, would, wouldn't it be easier to hide in a higher income one? I mean, you can't just suddenly pump a billion dollars through some bar that makes like five cents a month. It's not just Bahala. Any small bar with small income is being investigated heavily right now. So the closure notice is due to low sales? Among the reasons a bar can it acts, low sales is the rarest one. If low sales are a problem, lots of bars will close every year. We'll find out soon enough, huh? Sorry? So we're being inve so we have been laundering or something. Good. Seems you guessed was spot on, Gil. Hmm? If it helps, I'm doing my best to appeal in your place. Really? Why? Most of Glitch City's bars are pain in the ass. They constantly give reports of chemical damage or shady drinks. This is one of the few places from which I never receive complaints. The closest thing to a recent complaint was that whole farmer fabrics affair a little, little while ago. So much saliva. Oh, and apparently the dog piss episode was the prologue, which I guess people didn't like as much as the main game. I, I didn't play the prologue or the demo. They're apparently different from the main game. Um, but yeah, whatever. I wouldn't get my hopes up, though. Especially since the BTC will try to save face by axing as many suspects as possible. No, your making an effort is enough. Thanks. Can I get anything else? Now that I remember, the recipe book has a drink created here, right? Oh yeah, the suplex. Give me one of those, please. Let's do Brian the suplex. Bloop. Three flandrides. Oops. I'm glad we're not penalized for the resets. I haven't really had too many resets, but uh... Aw, oh, crap. On the rocks. One, two, three. There you go, bro. Here. The registry form said this was an accident while making a pile driver. You can ask the creator to drink just over there. Ah, so you're Robert. Yes, that's my name. I'm Robert, the one and only. Excuse me. Jill called you Gil, though. Uh, it's Argentinian <laughs> slang. Robert here is from Argentina. We call him Gil. Huh. Let me see. Awkward silence. Sorry, Brian, I was certain some stuff at the office. Please come in. I'll be right there. Any other questions, Jill? Not really, now. Although, yeah. If you were to evaluate my performance right now, how would you rate me? Clean and timely delivery of the correct orders. A top notch bartender. Thanks. Now, if you'll excuse me. Surprised you haven't met him before. I received my training in another city. Regional supervisor, some girl with a red mohawk. Ah, I see. I wonder what boss will talk to Brian about. Ugh, Jill, was it? Ah, Miss Stella, what a pleasure. Dot, dot, dot. Are you okay? Yeah, um, just call me Stella. And give me a big beer, please. Uh, sure. That doesn't seem like your kind of thing. Whatever. Deltas. 
eight of these things. The itch factory has left my desk. Next. There you are, big beer. You seem upset. Have your jimmies been rustled? Are you sure you're fine? Um, you know Sai, right? You know Sai, right? She was at the Apollo Trust Bank during that whole affair, and... Oh. Right, that. So she... She didn't show up on the list of the massive body count in the aftermath, so... I was hoping maybe you'd seen her. As much as I'd love to say that I had... Yeah, I figured as much. What are you doing? Suddenly, a lot heavier. I mean, I can tell her everything will be alright. That's not a bit condescending. I was going to do in this kind of situation. Be a joke? Not that you're tasteless. Awkward. Is distracting her be enough? I don't think clearly under this kind of pressure, do I? I, don't, I just. She's got the Reaver bot eye too. So uh, there's a private eye here in the other day. I. Sorry, I'm a bit on edge. A private detective, I take it. Yeah, maybe you'll want his services. What's his name? I believe it was Art Van. No, Von Delay. Oh, that Art guy. Actually, no, I hired him yesterday to look for Sai. So you still have hope. I'm somewhere between bargaining and depression right now. I'm afraid to let go of bargaining. I see. Is he any good? He doesn't look it, but he's quite skilled at gathering intel. I believe he'll give him, give me answers about Psy, whenever they may be. Sometimes I wish I had a magic wand so I could solve all my problems with the swing, you know? Sorry if I'm making you uncomfortable. Oh, sorry now. It's not about feeling uncomfortable, it's just weird. Usually I try to say something to my clients when I see them down. Right now I can't find any words that don't sound hypocritical, useless, or tasteless. I'm glad to know you have that much common sense, at least. All I can do is get you drinks. Can I get you anything else? Something sweet. That'll help me calm down a bit. Gladly. Something sweet. Sweet and expensive. Sorry, Stella, but I got bills to pay. I think, I think Brantini. Oh, wait, no! Piano Woman, definitely. I guess I should have been scoping out. I didn't think money would be this much of an issue, but I guess money is like the primary difficulty, in fact. I should have been looking for more expensive uh, drinks in some situations. Where's your Piano Woman? Thanks. See, it's really like sight. You know, most people would be like, I don't know. Do, do people go into bars like not knowing what crap costs? I guess maybe they do. Uh, I've never been a big par bar person. Prefer to make my own drinks. Seems you really like sight. I don't have brothers or sisters. My social interactions are usually strictly business. So Sai is more than a friend to me. She's she's sorry. I brought up that topic at a bad time. Don't worry about it. As I was saying, she's more than a friend. She's my emotional support. She's someone I can trust wholeheartedly. I'd say she's like my sister, but siblings usually lack that level of trust. I have to deal with high-class pricks of every race and upbringing on a daily basis. They use a business mask to hide everything they don't want others to know, and I do the same. Both sides I can be myself. I can do whatever I want and vent all my frustrations. She's always been there for me. Now she might need me. Here I am, sitting in a bar, making other people do that job because I'm a useless pile of flesh. And secrets. Sorry about the outburst. I'm actually kind of jealous of the level of self-control you're using here. I mean, I'd be a mess in that situation. Still, would you like some fresh air? I'm gonna take my break, you can use some time. For a given value of fresh. I'm fine, thanks. Okay then. Gil? Please surface Miss Stella, if you know what I mean. Sure, leave it to me. Look at this girly boy over here. 
who who is Twin Tails here? Like this is Boss. This is Stella. This this is Dorothy. Who is Twin Tails? Is this Jill? Oh, I guess that's Jill. We see Jill so little. I I forget what she looks like. All right then. I probably shouldn't have left this gap. I left this gap as a reminder. We're gonna run out of save slots. I mean, assuming I'm less than halfway through the game anyway. <laughs> well, that was an even shorter episode than usual. I swear, these are just, this is just gonna keep getting shorter. Whatever. I figured I would do one break per episode so that stay tuned next time for more drama.